stop doing. And I think the doing really does link to the deep questions around the need to fund movements directly as opposed to fund work that is led by white people because I think it's easier to do work around inclusion, right, and diversity where you're making organizations more equitable than actually funding and investing in intersectional movements that are led by Black and Brown and Indigenous people. There is sometimes paternalism in funding. So we try to save particular kinds of people, which is a problem because it replicates power. But I think there's also something about disrupting the notion of silos. You know, I will take the fact that you don't have housing, but I don't deal with the fact that you don't have water. And I think as long as we are locked into funding models that are so tightly siloed, we miss the point of the longer term work around change that is holistic.